airline pressure. Coming up, usually run at about 115 to 120 PSI, so it's quite a bit of pressure. And bring this in right about there. Go after it a little bit here. See this bone over here, it's actually a, a dentary. It's the left dentary, it's the lower jaw that holds the teeth. Uh, and it keeps going in this direction. And it should curve up like this somehow, because I think we're somewhere really kind of near the animal's chin. A lot of the specimen is in this really soft sandstone that, that literally will just like crumble to dust. Um, and so when that's what's going on, a lot of times we don't even need power tools. We can just use like dental picks and right. brushes and right. things and, and we can get there. The good news is, is that whether we're in hard rock that's more resistant and slower or we're in soft rock that goes away pretty quickly, in both cases it appears that the preservation of the fossil is about the same. And it turns out it's exquisite. Even though some of it is faster and some of it's slower, uh, it all pays great dividends. Uh, so we're thrilled. If you step back from that a little bit and think about it, and it's like, you know, that's actually kind of profound just to think about that, like, your eyes are the first to have ever looked at that particular part of that animal, uh, ever. Like, no other human has ever seen that. And uh, it's just kind of a neat connection to the very, very deep past.